The School of Social Work at the University of Minnesota is starting the new school year with a new director. St. Paul native Dr. Joan Blakey is making history. She's the first black woman to fill the role. We not only look at the person, but we, we believe that you are shaped by your environment. In July, Dr. Joan Blakey began work as the director of the School of Social Work at the University of Minnesota. Established in 1917, she's the first black woman to hold the title. You don't get to this place without having high expectations and pushing yourself. So I push myself a lot um, and I have a lot of high expectations for myself. She earned her bachelor's degree here and her master's and received a PhD from the University of Chicago. The St. Paul native spent years at Tulane University in New Orleans before returning home. I think being able to come back and in a different role, in a different position, and give back to the school means a lot to me. Having experienced homelessness at the age of 16, Dr. Blakey's story is one of strength, endurance, and faith. There were people that were just, they saw something in me and they just kept pouring into me and kept believing and kept pushing and kept saying, you know, you can do this. Blakey says that student interest in the field of social work right now appears to be on the decline. There is a great need and there there is not enough social workers to fill those, those needs. And that's where she says recruitment is key. I think there's a lot good here. I think it's just how do we make it better? How do we make it more accessible? How do we make it more um, relatable to what students are needing right now. For Dr. Blakey, it's a return to familiar territory, serving in a different role. A new journey begins. What I do admire about the students today is that they do believe that they have a right to, you know, an education that is reflective of them, that, um, you know, meets their needs, that prepares them for to tomorrow. Dr. Blakey is also a professor there at the U. She will be formally installed at a welcome reception next month. That event will take place October 12th at the St. Paul Event Center.